Here it is, what goes in between actors when they're doing a simulated schmeck scene on TV. If you're new here, my name is Jessica Steinbach. I'm an intimacy coordinator, which means I choreograph spicy scenes for television. Follow along if you've got questions. First things first, if you haven't watched my video about modesty garments, I'd recommend doing that now. Okay, now we're on the same page and we all know what this thing is. Ooh. It's important to remember that this garment alone only provides modesty, so this has no kind of protection or sensation barrier. Speaking of barriers, that's what we use them for. My general guideline is that we shouldn't be touching each other's genitals at work, and barriers are really important tools to help make sure that that doesn't happen. Now, just like modesty garments, barriers come in a wide variety of shapes, sizes, uh, all to fit the performer to make sure that they are the safest they can possibly be. But this is an example of what one may look like. It's a foam barrier that goes right inside the modesty garment, providing cushion and support for the actor. Now, there are a lot of factors that determine which barrier is the right barrier to use for any situation. That's the actor preference. That's what we're trying to see, what we're not trying to see uh, in the position the actors are going to be. So that's barriers in under a minute. How'd I do?